Hi everyone, welcome to a new flow on this channel. For those of you who don't know me, who are new to this channel, then hi, I'm Jana, I'm a yoga teacher. I film flows on this YouTube channel. Uh, my goal is to make yoga accessible to as many of you as possible. I use yoga as a tool to help you connect with your inner wisdom and live more aligned life with your potential and your inner world in general. I also have other offerings available. I'll link them all down below to the description. You can go check them out. And at this point when I'm filming this video, I do live streams on my Instagram every Monday. Uh, they are completely free to join. Uh, and yeah, it's a lot of fun. I call it a Monday reset. Uh, so each Monday you can join me on my yoga Instagram. It's possible that at this point I don't do those anymore. Uh, but for that reason I'm leaving all those offerings linked down in the description box so you can go check them out and see what is going on. <laughs> Alright, so this flow is going to be pretty short. It's going to be about 15 minutes long. It's that kind of flow that you can come back to any time. You can do it any time during the day. Uh, it is beginner friendly as well, so if you've been sitting for quite some time and you just feel like you need to get some movement in, this practice is perfect for that occasion. So without further ado, let's get started. We will get started sitting on our heels at the back of our mat. <sighs> sit, and, sit nice and tall, crown of our head is reaching high. Roll your shoulders back gently. Hmm. Reach the chest forwards, pull your ribs in, neutral spine. Hmm. On the next inhale, place your left hand on your right knee and bring your right hand behind you, twist. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, see if you can turn a little bit deeper. Your gaze might go to the back of the room or of your other space. Inhale, come back to center. Let's repeat the same on the other side. Place your right hand on your left knee and left hand reaches behind. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist. Gaze going to the back of the room. Try to get deeper with each exhale. Inhale, come back to center, beautiful. On the next inhale, let's come back to all fours. Make sure your hands are underneath your shoulders, your knees are underneath your hips. On the next inhale, lift your Right arm high up to the sky, exhale, thread the needle. So thread it all the way to the left. Place your right cheek on the ground, on your mat. Don't forget to breathe. Next, inhale, come back to center. Let's repeat the same on the other side. Left arm reaches up. Exhale, thread it all the way to the right. Place your left cheek on the ground. Nice twist. And on the next inhale, come back to center. Tuck your toes under and on the exhale, lift your bum all the way up to the sky for your first downward facing dog. Reaching your sitting bones high up to the sky, pushing away from the ground, aligning your ears with your upper arms, making space for your shoulder blades by externally rotating those upper arms. You might keep your knees bent. Just make sure you are really stretching your hamstrings here, so the back sides of your legs. Drawing your abdomens in and towards your thighs. 
Back is straight. Beautiful. On the next inhale, step your right foot to the front of the mat. Place your left knee down to the ground, easy twist. Reach your right arm up to the sky. Opening the chest here. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, reach your right arm under your right knee, round. So hug your knee in. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, round. Right knee is bent all the time. Inhale, up. Exhale, round. Inhale, up. And exhale, round. Beautiful. One more inhale, easy twist. Exhale, frame, frame your foot between your hands. Tuck your toes under and come back to downward facing dog. Maybe take your dog for a little walk. Okay, come back to stillness and on the next inhale, left foot steps forward, easy twist on the other side. Inhale, reach your left arm high up to the sky, open the chest. Exhale, round your back, reach your left arm under your left knee. Round the back here. Inhale. Exhale, round. Inhale, up. Exhale, and round. Inhale up, exhale, place your left hand down next to your left foot, frame the left foot between your hands and step it all the way back to a downward facing dog. Reaching your sitting bones high up to the sky, pushing away from the ground. On the next inhale, come to your tiptoes and let's walk step by step all the way to the front of the mat. So you are really engaging your core, making tiny, teeny steps. All the movement is coming from the hips, walking your way all the way to the front of the mat. Bend your knees if you need to. Inhale, half lift. Look to the front of the mat. Exhale, forward fold. Shift your weight gently towards the front towards your toes. Keep your knees, knees bent if you need to. Sitting bones are reaching high. And you are trying to draw your abdomen towards your thighs. Relax your head, relax your shoulders. Interlace your fingers behind your back and bring your arms overhead. Don't forget to breathe. And on the next inhale, release your hands and gently <laughs> roll yourself up vertebrae by vertebrae. Hmm. Ah, oh, mountain pose, Tadasana. Very well done. On the next inhale, ground down for your left foot and bring your right knee towards your chest. Keep your left hand on your right knee. Reach your right arm behind. If you found stability or a little challenge, you can try to shift your gaze towards your right hand. You're really trying to open here. Amazing. Come back to center and a big step with your right foot. Big step back to a half split. So big step back. Place your right knee down to the ground. Start extending your left leg, flexing the foot and come to a half split. Make sure your spine is long here, back is straight. You are trying to lower the abdomen in the direction of your leg. Stretching the left hamstrings here. 
crown of your head is reaching forwards. Amazing. On the next inhale, let's come to a high lunge just for a second. Reach your arms up and step in to Tadasana, to standing. Beautiful. Let's ground down through the right foot now. Lift left knee towards the chest. Leave your right hand on your left knee and open your left arm behind. Keep opening your chest, opening your heart space. Be mindful of your left knee, make sure it's still high. Your gaze might follow your left hand, if that feels good. Beautiful. <laughs> All the wobbles. Okay, come back to center, knee is lifted and step it all the way back to that half split. So big step, place your left knee down to the ground, start straightening your right leg, flexing the right foot and try lower your torso down towards your right leg, making sure the spine is long. You're really stretching that right hamstring here. Beautiful stretch. On the next inhale, let's come back through that high lunge. Just for a moment. And step it in. Mountain pose, Tadasana, beautiful. <sighs> Hands by your sides, palms facing forwards. Hmm. Roll your shoulders back. Let the shoulder blades travel down the spine. Open the chest. Pull your ribs in as well. Crown of your head reaching high. Wonderful. Widen your feet a little bit more, more than hip width distance. And gently, slowly, let's start lowering down to Malasana. Four, three, two, one beautiful. If this is perhaps too much for you. If it doesn't, if it just doesn't feel comfortable, feel free to lift your heels up, or and support yourself with your hands. If you are feeling pretty comfortable here, you can place your hands to prayer. Try to push away your knees with your elbows. Straight back. Really try to lengthen your spine here, reaching the crown of your head high up to the sky. Amazing. And gently, slowly start lowering down to your bum. Sit down. Hug your knees in just for a second. Inhale through nose. Exhale through mouth. Let go. Thank yourself, thank your body for being here for you all the time, not only for this practice, but allowing you to do all the tasks that you do throughout the day, allowing you to be here with us in this space. <sighs> And gently, slowly, lower yourself down. We'll take a very short Shavasana today. So come down, lying on your back. And I invite you to take this variation with your legs bent. And let your knees come together. Pushing your lower back down to the ground. Pull your shoulders away from your ears. Palms of your hands are facing up. And just be for a moment. Let go of any thoughts that are no longer serving you, that are no longer serving your purpose.
Perhaps breathe into those areas of your body that need some extra love today. If you are feeling a little bit down, breathe into your heart. To let that prana flow, to release the prana vital energy. And slowly start noticing your body again, your fingers, your toes, your wrists. If you are ready, roll over your favorite side and come back to a comfortable seated position. Uh, maybe cross-legged, maybe on your heels. Place your hands over each other at the heart center. We'll take one big releasing breath together. Inhale through nose. Exhale through mouth. Let go. <sighs> Namaste. Well, thank you so much for flowing with me today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you feel energized and ready to carry out with your day. And I cannot wait to see you next time. Bye-bye.